our Camden is here this morning, WBAL TV's puppy with a purpose and a future service dog from America's Vet Dogs. And of course, as always, joined with uh, Razor Dina Stone and Dina, America's Vet Dogs really came back into national attention oh, yeah. this week. We saw John doing a lot of interviews in New York, your uh, leader there, talking about Sully. Yes, so um, obviously very sad times to, to uh, right now, but um, seeing Sully in the spotlight in America's Vet Dogs, obviously, it was kind of a good thing, but um, what I find great about it is the nation has, as a majority, really rallied around yeah. Sully, yeah. wondering, you know, what Sully's thinking and feeling yeah. and um, the yeah. pictures. This photograph in particular is has touched so many people. Yes. Mm -hmm. Just, and you, uh, we were just saying, you have to wonder what the dog realizes what the dog understands, what the dog doesn't understand is going on. Right. I think we could all just guess what we think. Sure. Yeah. Obviously, we'll never know. But, um, you know, I do know that Sully obviously made a huge impact sure. on President Bush's life and probably all those around him. Mm -hmm. um, and happy to know that Sully is going to have, continue to have a great purpose in life and yeah. by going to Walter Reed. And he's going to be there as one of our facility dogs and helping um, people who were there in physical and occupational therapy. Just um, the facility dogs at Walter Reed, whereas as compared to a service dog, where we're like, okay, don't pet a service dog, you know, they have a job mm -hmm. to do. Sure. Their job at Walter Reed is to just be loved on and oh, be support oh, and, wonderful. you know, for people to lean on them a little bit um, emotionally. Mm -hmm. And, um, and so. that's a job he's earned. Sally has earned absolutely. that. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. So I'm excited. He's sure. gonna be in the area and mm -hmm. um, just a really great purpose. That is cool. Tell us about your girl, Busy Time. <gasps> went in a parade this week. Yeah, Saturday we went to the um, the Avenue at White Marsh and um, that parade was huge. <laughs> I had no, no idea what to expect. It was their 20th annual parade and it was absolutely huge, but great exposure for her, you know, hundreds and hundreds of people. Yeah. Um, a lot of um, loud um, mm -hmm. entries mm -hmm. and she just took it all in stride. Yeah. And um, yesterday and today, um, later this morning, will be the Gaylord for a, uh, a private event with a, uh, an organization who's raising money for her. But oh, nice. her and Sister Smudge joined us. Smudge as an ambassador to the Guide Dog Foundation. And um, Camden representing America's Vet Dogs going and um, just meeting people there and being able to talk about America's Vet Dogs. Yeah. So I love fantastic. it. And the holidays are always an exciting time for everybody, and it's a great uh, learning opportunity for, for the dogs. Right, absolutely. And this time of, um, of year, there's a lot of different um, <laughs> decorations outside, too. Mm -hmm. And just to have, for her to be able to see these decorations and hear some of the humming they make and the flashes and just be okay with it. But it is it's an exciting time, though. And by the way, we really saw the power of this dog on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> he just wanted to reach out for like 100 more followers. Then you got what hundreds <laughs> right and even I, I think because having Sully in the um, in the news the last couple of days yeah. her Instagram mm -hmm. is growing and now <laughs> oh hi Smudge Smudge, Smudge is coming in. to say I, hi Smudge said hi. enough oh, enough of oh, all this Camden God. talk <laughs> but yes so Camden's Instagram is growing yeah. enough to where I kind of think that she can make it to 10,000 followers she can do it. Let's do by it. the end of the year. End of the year, 10,000 followers. <laughs> Ava, I'm telling you, this will be easy to do. Dina, thank you for coming thank also. Thank you.